hi welcome to my channel as you can see my channel is about mixed media art right now mostly vintage grunge but you may find some watercolor from time to time or whatever else might pique my interest I do hope you enjoy my channel and I hope you stay around for a very long time enjoy hi there I'm here today to do a little bit of work on my grungy envelope journal um, that you guys uh, may or may not have been following along and I'm doing something today that I've never done before so we're gonna hope that it works out okay and what I'm using is some yellow beeswax now I got this on uh, Amazon and I got it in the bars can't see it but I got it in the bars look like this because it was cheaper than getting the I don't want to say granulated but the pearlized kind and what I did was I took a, a serrated an old serrated uh, knife like this and um, just uh, sort of shaved shaved some of the beeswax off and um, I absolutely love the effect that this has and um, I have seen Lori Girl on the Ridge do this and I know there was another person that I did see do this but now I can't remember who it was but um, I know I've seen Lori Girl on the Ridge do it and uh, she has the little pearlized kind uh, but I like I said I didn't get that kind because it was too it was more expensive than what I wanted to pay um, and because I'm, I'm not going to be using this a ton so uh, so anyway I'm putting some of that it came out looking like that by the way <laughs> um, after I scraped it with my little knife so I'm gonna put some of that on there and <clears throat> I don't really want it to get on to my little craft iron <clears throat> I have a little craft iron here um, that I got at a second hand store but it just really works well so I I'm going to put it put my uh, craft mat down um, because my craft mat is supposed to be heat resistant so like I said I'm praying that this works because <laughs> I've never done it before and yeah so it melted it just fine um, and it just um, kind of gives it a real cool like glazed type look um, and then it's left a little bit here on my craft mat but I think I can get that off with some hot water I might put it just a little bit more on there and see Oh yeah that looks that looks pretty neat I'll let that cool off and then I'll get that off of there but um, it's just yeah it's just regular yellow beeswax um, I'm not sure if this So there, I hope you can see it. Anyway, I'll have to look at, at the at the other gals' um, um, uh, tutorials again regarding this, regarding putting the beeswax down and see if I if I'm doing it right or wrong or what's going on with it but um but yeah I just wanted to try that out and I wanted to show you too that I've made some I put some I took some book page and um, just uh, uh, I I did back it with some just some plain uh, some cardstock uh, 
ivory colored cardstock and um, did some stamping on it. So I made a few of these to go in my little book. And um, I put, put a couple more here and I put a couple or one on some book page. So I'm going to tear those up and use those for, for different odds and ends. But um, let's see if it's dry. Yep, it's dry and cool. So I was thinking, I forget which page I was thinking of putting that on. And I have done a few more things in here that I will have to come on and show you. Oh, this one right here, I think. I think I'll go ahead and put that down right there and make kind of like a little low, low belly band like. Or maybe I'll even, you know, glue just down along the bottom edge and make it a, make it a little tuck spot. Yeah, I think I'll do that. So, but at any rate, um, that's going to be everything for today. I'm going to turn this little iron off. At least I think I'm turning it off. This is, like I said, this is the first I've ever used it. Used it. It's a cute little thing, and I didn't want to, I didn't want to, to iron right on the beeswax with, with the, uh, the craft iron because uh, I didn't want to ruin it. So okay, I'm just putting this glue down along the edges here. how these little book pages turned out. This is going down over the corner so it's a little being a little bit resistant to sticking. But I will beat it into submission here. Make it stick. So yeah there we go. So it makes a little tuck right here. There we go. So I'll have to find something to tuck into that little spot. I think I've got a tag here that I've made or something. I've got yeah, oh, this, one of these little tags might go in there okay. I don't know, I might have to get a little bit shorter one. Make a little bit shorter one since I put the tuck up so high. Or put in something else. I don't know. But <laughs> but anyway, we'll see. So that's that's all today. Um, I, I don't know if this is right or not. It really kind of made a cool, like, it feels cool. <laughs> that uh, that beeswax on there so yeah uh, but anyway that's kind of what it looks like so you can see the kind of glaze that it has on it now but anyway so that's all I'm going to do for today just a little short video and um, thank you for watching so much thank you to all my new subscribers and um, stay stick with me uh, for a long while uh, please and uh, till I visit with you next time God bless you bye bye